Problem number 27, wastewater collection math, sewergeek.com. A 480 volt AC pump motor draws 22 amps. What is the horsepower output of the motor if the power factor is 0.78 and the pump efficiency is 89%? Well, we'll do a quick drawing of what we're talking about here. There's my motor, 480 volts, and there's my pump, the pump efficiency is 89% or 0.89, power factor is 0.78. and they want to know the horsepower output which is the water horsepower basically oh they want to know the horsepower output of the motor that's brake horsepower the output of the motor not of the pump which means we also don't care that it's 0.89 efficient we're only looking for the output of the motor, the brake horsepower, so the pump efficiency means nothing. So now all I've got to do, we've got 480 volts at 22 amps. Volts times amps equals watts. So 480 volts times 22 amps. That should be about 10, 12,000. 480 times 22, 10, 560. 10,560 watts. We also know that there are 746 watts per horsepower. From the formulas in the front of the book, we get that. And so if I, if I divide 10,560 by 746, I should get something like 12-ish. It's probably, it's not going to be 7, it's not going to be not, uh, B. It's not going to be B or D. So I'll take 10,560 divided by 746, and I get 14.15 horsepower. And that's brake horsepower. That's actually input horsepower because we haven't figured in the 0.78 on the power factor. So now I'm going to go times 0.78, and that's going to give me times 0.78. It's going to give me 11.04 horsepower. And that mistake's something to keep an eye out for because if you were taking a test and you did what I just did and forgot about the power factor. 14.15 would probably be here. We just throw an E 14.15. That would have been there for you to grab. What is there? Since the answer is 11 horsepower, the answer is definitely C. But what is there is if I took the 11 times 0.89, that would give me 9.83. That's there for me to grab if I kept going. The answer is C.